The fourth round of the Rugby Sevens takes place tomorrow at Legends Rugby Ground with Dusupe Warriors playing the role of hosts. Dubbed the Mileke Sevens, Warriors player cam coach Gabriel Aredo admits that the leg is not steeped in history. The Milekes are actually my parents. Uh, me, myself, Gabriel, Joseph Aredo, the one in Cobbs and uh, Erasmus Aredo, Warriors. Those guys have been supporting us for the longest time as uh, their kids and also as uh, a team and uh, rugby in general in Uganda. So for them, when they say there's a rugby game over the weekend and then uh, there's some other event, the coin normally lands on the side of rugby for them. Warriors uh, as a concept, uh, when it was still summer camp, was just an invitational side for the rugby sevens. When it kicked off, I think in about uh, 2002 or six, I'm not really but uh, when it kicked off, it was just an, an invitational side. The seventh circuit has over time provided Warriors a learning curve of sorts. It has also given new players getting a priceless chance to bed in. It's been improving uh, from circuit to circuit. I know ideally the best thing to do is you come out, uh, you come off the blocks uh, at full speed. But uh, given the, the new crop of players that we have, most of them don't have that uh, elementary rugby basic that uh, comes with most of the other teams. Uh, most of the other teams have, like, uh, let me say, gathered all throughout the years. So we finished uh, fourth in the last uh, leg. Would like to make it into the top three, probably even win it. Aredo hopes the challenges faced during the season can be creased out via the seven circuit. We got off to a good start in the beginning of the league. We had six, we went six games unbeaten. I think we went top the table at some point. We, that's where now the challenges you're asking about start showing up. When we got that break, that uh, Christmas break, a lot of players switch off. Some of them do not have their mental ability to stay tuned or locked to the task at hand. So when they came back, some of the squad came back, some of the squad did not come back. So you know, you know how it is when you're in an amateur sport and then you're trying to make ends meet, trying to make it uh, work for you. Pirates will be looking to tie up Cobbs, who are front runners in the circuit with two wins. But for Warriors, it's all about celebrating little milestones. It was back in 2002 that the club, then a loose entity, played on the circuit as a Sevens Invitational side. 17 years later, they are rubbing shoulders with the big guns as a core team. Felix Manindo, NTV Weekend Sport.